you, Stuart. Now, some people spend their entire lives wishing for amazing things they'll never get. Others just focus on doing amazing things with whatever they have. Now, this past March, Arizona State senior Anthony Robles won an NCAA wrestling title, capping a perfect 36-0 season, the tournament's most outstanding wrestler. Uh, Anthony was born with only one leg, and that shouldn't matter to you, even if it never really mattered to him. Take a look. I remember the first time I saw Anthony wrestle. I went in the stands, and my son threw down his crutches, and he he hopped to the middle of the, the mat. And there's this scrawny little kid, and you know, that's my son, and I was so proud of him, but this woman was laughing, and um, it broke my heart. I never wanted him to look at himself and say, hey, something's wrong with me because these people keep looking at me and pointing. But if anybody's known Anthony throughout his whole life, it's that big smile, that great personality, you know, and, and never letting anything get him down. Even when they ask him, you know, what happened to your leg? He's like, I was born that way. Just with confidence, he just says it. I know Anthony made it a point that he wanted to go to Division I school. He had worked really hard with two undefeated seasons, two state titles. But he wasn't heavily recruited. He knew he had something to prove once again. When he first started, it was like, oh, poor thing. You know, good for him. He's trying. He's, you know, he's got one leg. He's at a disadvantage. And then as he started winning, it was, well, he's got an advantage because he's got all that upper body strength and, you know, people can't get low enough. And I'm like, no, the kid just figured out how to beat you guys. And it will be a tall task for Anthony Robles, the senior from Mesa, Arizona, seven minutes away from a national title. I was scared for him, knowing that it had to be Iowa, knowing that it had to be the former champion. Look at that beautiful technique by Robles. For anybody to give Anthony any credit, it had to be the best of the best. The recipient of this year's Jimmy V Award for Perseverance, Anthony Robles. most of us are here tonight isn't because what we've accomplished. It's because of the sacrifices and encouragement that certain people have given us at critical times in our lives. And you just saw who sacrificed for me and encouraged me. And that was my mom, Judy Robles. When I was born, my birth dad immediately bailed 
I was born with one leg, and my mom could have walked away and just given me up for adoption, but she didn't. She taught me to never let what I cannot do interfere with what I can do. And she didn't protect me from pain and failure because she knew it would make me stronger. Even when my mom got sick at the beginning of my sophomore year in college, and my stepdad walked out on the family, and we lost our home, and I wanted to quit wrestling to get a job to help pay the bills, my mom refused to let any of us give up. And here I am today, national champion. I must also thank Arizona State University, Sun Devils, for giving me one of the finest educations in the world. And my friend Chris Freegee and my high school coach Bobby Williams, who took me under their wrestling wings to push me every step of the way. And now, as I go forward with so much more to do, this is my message. Every soul who comes to earth with the leg or two at birth must wrestle his opponents knowing it's not what is, it's what can be that measures worth. Make it hard, just make it possible. And through pain, I'll not complain. My spirit is unconquerable. Fearless, I will face each foe, for I know I am capable. I don't care what's probable. Through blood, sweat, and tears, I am unstoppable. Thank you.